Welcome to Galen IAS Botany Option Program. Today, I am here to conduct the session of Art of Writing Botany Answer. Before I begin the session, certain things you need to know about Art of Writing Botany Answer. Answer writing, which is very important in UPSC Civil Service mains exam. To score well in the mains exam, you need to know how to write a good answer. Writing an impressive answer is still a daunting task to many UPSC aspirants. Albert Einstein once said that you should be well aware of the rules of the game then only you can play it better than anyone else the problem is we don't know the rules of the game when we started our op optional preparation we are always concerned about the content of the subject isn't it which notes to study which institute to join which books to refer this was one of the major concern of every upsc aspirant when they started their preparation when i started my preparation i also get concerned about this content is important in optional subject apart from the content there is one more important aspect in mains exam that is answer writing practice and again that question is still exist how to write a good answer to address this i just picking up a question from 2019 civil service mains exam and the question is write the causal agent symptoms and control measures of yellow vein of okra and tundu disease of wheat this is a 20 mark question so while you are writing mains exam you get a question come answer booklet this was the this was the outline of the question booklet so here the question is there and on the right hand right and left side there is a margin and they are specifically mentioned that do not write on the margin so you get only this much of area to address the question this is a 20 mark question so you get four sides to answer this question and the question is from the microbiology and plant pathology unit of paper 1 this is very important topic in paper what microbiology and plant pathology unit every year you get at least two or three questions from this topic uh, specifically from the important crop diseases caused by nematode fungi virus bacteria microplasma so let's address the question firstly you have to identify the key points of that particular question so what was the key points of this particular question and here the key points are causal agent symptoms and control measures so this is a direct question so no need of writing introduction if you need introduction if you want to write introduction you can write introduction too but the introduction must be short and precise for example what will we write as introduction in yellow vein of okra so you can write that okra which is widely grown on tropical subtropical and warm temperature regions of the world and 3.9% of uh, share of vegetable production in india is from okra and you can also mention the major producers of the okra in indian state so this was the introduction for that particular disease yellow vein of okra and the introduction must be short and precise so let's come to the body part so you have to address all the three key points of that particular question so here yellow vein of okra what was the causal agent of yellow vein of okra yellow vein of okra which is a viral disease and it is caused by bigomo virus next is the symptoms i am not addressing all the symptoms of that particular disease just one or two so what are the symptoms of this particular disease allowing of the entire network network of veins of leaf bud leaf blade
and next is infection restricts flowering and fruit formation So next is the control measures. We can subdivide the control measures into cultural measures, chemical measures and physical measures. So disease resistant varieties can be used for restricting the spread of disease and it can be considered as a cultural measures and the disease resistant varieties for yellow vein of okra is arca abe and arca anamica next is the chemical measures spraying monocrotophus 1.5 ml per liter of water reduces the spread of disease So next is the Tundu disease of wheat. Next is Tundu disease of wheat. Tundu disease of wheat is caused by the action of a nematode and a bacteria. The association of this nematode and bacteria will bring this Tundu disease of wheat. And here the nematode is Aguna triticae and the bacteria which is Cornibacterium triticae. The symptoms of this disease is galls were formed on seeds. As a result of next symptom is as a result of infection, a yellow exudate which appears on the head and neck of wheat and it inhibits the elongation or prevent elongation. So, galls formed on seeds is by the action of nematode. Next is control measures. And here the cultural measure is
non infected seeds were sown in a different field chemical measure soak the seeds in strong solution of common salt to reduce the gold formation on seeds Next is the physical measure. as soon as the symptoms occurs the infected plants are uprooted and bought this is a physical measure to reduce the spread of tundu disease this is a way to address the question if you are addressing all the questions in this manner definitely you you can score well in the mains exam if you are scoring well in mains exam definitely you will be in the final rank list and we gallant ias assure you that we can guide you to the world of answer writing and the highlights of gal and ias are both online and offline courses conducting regular test series answer writing practices and individual feedback and individual mentorship subscribe our channel for further updates related botany option thank you for watching